Hey guys, it's Clay. Welcome back to the channel. Um, I was doing a mail day, but I decided to uh, scrap the actual mail day and uh, we're gonna change things up and we're gonna do a soaking of two 1983 Ryan Sandberg rookies. Now, if you're familiar with soaking or if you, <laughs> if you have a, a, an aversion to the soaking process, Go ahead, click off the video. But if you're interested, like I am, then stay tuned because what we're gonna do is we're first going to submerge both of these in water. And uh, to do this, you wanna use distilled water, no other water. Um, you would then, after three to five hours, I'm gonna give these both five hours to soak. We're then gonna take them out. We're gonna let them dry. We're gonna put them between two planks of wood with uh, paper towels, but in this case, I'm not gonna use paper towels. I'm gonna use the shop towels because they have less debris and they're more absorbent. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna soak them for five hours, let them sit between two wooden planks with a weight on them and covered by uh, paper towels for a further one to two hours until they're dry and then we're gonna compare. So I'm gonna do some uh, quick pictures of the areas that are uh, kind of troubling me here, and I'll show them to you as well. Maybe we can, if this light will cooperate in this. Let's see, there we go. So the problem with the OPG is that it has kind of a divot here. It's a long running divot. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there. Now it doesn't go through the actual paper facade itself. It's more of a groove. So I think that maybe uh, soaking and then you know applying pressure to it might even that out. If it doesn't, then it doesn't, but we're not gonna damage the card. We also have this one, which I think could probably benefit the most from the soaking because it has, it looks like some kind of, uh, I can put it under, you can see that right there. It has some sort of tape residue here and on here, you can see that right there. Yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to see if soaking will take care of that. It'll, it should separate away from the card after about five hours. And um, yeah, let me put some more light on here. After about five hours. Now, one thing soaking is not gonna do, it's not gonna repair corners, it's not gonna fix paper loss, um, but these corners look really good in my opinion. And if they stand up to the soaking really well, and look at the centering on, on the back here, that's really good. If they stand up to the soaking, um, I'll try to submit them uh, to either PSA or uh, SGC and see what they get. Um, but anyway, so this, uh, this video is going to take a little bit longer than a typical video, but uh, what I'm going to do now is just go ahead and put them in the water. Each one's going to get its own container. We're going to use distilled water, like I said before. Stand up for this so my voice might seem a little more distant. And pour, we're going to put the, should be enough. We're going to go ahead and put the OPG in this one. There it goes. And don't worry, I have done this before with, uh, with very good results. One thing it'll also do is take away a lot of the, uh, the dirt and grime over the years. So it may not be quite as loud of a smell. <laughs> so here's the tops. 
As you can see, this one's already bowing in the water. That's fine. We're just going to submerge it for a while. There we go. Might add a little more water to this one just because it's curling up. But I think its buoyancy is going to be taken care of once it completely gets soaked. It's going to most likely float to the bottom. But there we go. I know it's scary, guys, but there it goes. So two Ryan Sandberg rookies. I'm going to leave them covered. And we'll start a timer for five hours. Three hours later. Okay, guys, this is a three-hour check-in. We still got two more hours to go. If we look, this is the tops. Remember, tops is the one that had the, uh, the stuff on top. The, uh, I guess you can call it like tape residue. So that one's sitting well. I don't, it's, the, the water got a little darker. You can see it's, uh, so it's, you know, actively cleaning. And the OPG, see the water's a little bit uh, cleaner. But it's still soaking, still doing its thing. We'll check back in in two more hours. Okay guys, uh, we're gonna audible. I'm gonna call it good at four hours. So it's been a total of four hours of soaking. Um, let's go ahead and pop them open and have a look. So here's the tops. Looks pretty good. Um, I don't see that same residue, but again, it's, it's underwater. So what we're gonna do is very, very carefully, we're gonna remove it and place it on here, which is just a, an unfinished wood plank with a uh, just a shop towel. And I choose a shop towel over a paper towel because it's less debris. So let's go ahead and see if we can get this out. I'm gonna go ahead and remove some of the water. this one out without tear, taking out the water that might make it easier for us because I wanted to the last one wanted to stick. Okay, let's go. There we so the water's a little bit dirtier. Not a not a huge difference. But I think we've actually been able to remove some of that uh, some of that uh, tape residue. So let's have a look at these. First thing I'm gonna do is try to pat these dry. Very nice. You notice the, this one's curling, but this one's not, which is a little odd. But once we put them under a fair amount of weight, flat weight, I think it'll be fine. Looks really good. We're just patting very gently, absorbing some of the water. Another thing I'm going to do differently is I'm going to take this out of my office and we'll bring it down to my basement where we have a dehumidifier as well as an air purifier so we can help this dry up a little bit quicker. There we go. I'll meet you down in the basement. 
Okay guys, so we're here in my basement. I got the cards here. Right there. We're gonna put them here. I'm gonna take this weight, it's about 15 pounds. We're gonna to try and squeeze out the rest of the water. I'm gonna come back in one hour and uh, replace these uh, shop towels with fresh ones and then I'll put it on there for a further two hours and then I'll check them and just leave them out to dry once I believe that they're uh, to the point where they can have the weight removed. If you look, what's going to really help out is that there, this is only 43% uh, percent humidity in this room plus we have an air purifier so there you go. I think that's gonna help dry it out uh, quicker as well. So I will see you back in one hour. Okay guys, it has been about an hour. Just gonna see how we're looking. Very good. Let's set this. So they're still wet. That's fine. Okay, I just refresh the towel. So you can see the OPG still wants to. Oh, I think we actually don't want to get too. Uh, Wow, I think we actually may have gotten rid of the residue. We won't know until it completely dries, but right now they're looking really good. I know they don't look that great, but for what they've been through, they look wonderful right now, so. Okay guys, so these had a chance to sit down in the basement overnight. And as you can see, while we were able to get rid of some of the residue, it didn't completely take care of all of it but it certainly looks better, has a better appearance. Now I could try soaking this again, but I don't think it'll take care of that. But it's in, an, it's in, it's in good enough condition where I, I feel uh, that we've definitely made some progress. Now on the Opichi here, we've had a tremendous success that, that whole line that was there before is now completely gone. So the soaking did wonders for this. So very happy with the result on the Opichi, mildly happy with the tops, but there you go guys. So that's why people do this. You wanna have the best possible card you can and just all we're doing is adding distilled water and it does wonders. All right guys. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Uh, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.